Hey guys, welcome back. It's Clancy with 1013 Vintage where we talk quality thrifting and everything fancy. And we are here to start the new year with talking about six things to start our luxury collection. Okay guys, so we will be talking about six things to start our luxury collection, things that we could wear over and over again that will last a lifetime. And some of you do know that I have been both shopping um, at the thrift store and I've purchased a couple of new things. So let me start off with shoes. Shoes, we have to have a good shoe starting our luxury collection, whether it's a boot or a loafer. And let me show you some of the things that I got. So guys, you guys have seen this boot before. I've showed you this boot before. This Stuart Weitzman boot, you could wear for years. I've been having this boot well over three years. And it fits like a sneaker. It's sleek, it's suede, and this is something, if you were to buy one black heel boot, I would suggest buying the black, I wanna say this is the Stuart Weitzman Highland boot. This is something that you could wear and start your collection off and wear this pretty much every day. Another boot, this black flat boot. So if you are really into just starting your collection off with just a neutral color, I would really invest in a black or a brown boot. For me, I love wearing um, a lot of grays and creams and um, black. So I went with um, purchasing also this Stuart Weitzman black flat boot and all you need, that, that's pretty much all you need. You just need two boots, a heel and a flat. It will take you through the season perfectly. All that I thrifted these brand new, not even worn um, Chanel loafers. And can I just tell you the ballet flats, I haven't worn them yet, but these are just perfect to start your collection. Um, especially if you were trying to collect some luxury pieces. So yeah, I have these flats. I also have another pair of flats um, that are cream that I could work into my spring summer wardrobe. But for the most part, um, these flats and the two boots are perfect. Um, the next thing that I would talk about, the next item is coats. Um, I actually, I actually thrifted these two pieces that I've been having, one of them, I've been having probably about eight years. Um, I remember it. I thrifted it out of Savers for $9 and I've been wearing this for, it. and when I thrifted it, it actually had the tag on it. I couldn't believe it. I couldn't believe it. I don't even know if I have that in video because it was so very long ago, but um, Savers were, was just now opening up in our areas and I was going all the time. And let me show you the, the coat. Yes, it is a Burberry. And it is a Burberry navy blue trench Burberry Brit coat. I thrifted this for $9.99. And it has taken me over the years this is a perfect coat that if you were starting a, a collection, your luxury collection, you can start off with a beautiful trench coat. It has a, it has the tie to it, which I kind of just wear it tied in the knot in the back. But if you wanted to just wear it folded, you could just wear it such as this and the collar is up so you can see like the Burberry stripe. 
I could not believe I found this coat when I found it. And I actually have just been wearing it ever since. Um, I thrifted another coat probably a couple of weeks ago. It was a long khaki um, Burberry. Um, it was a vintage style. And I think I got that for like $15. So, you know, just having that coat of a different color and this, this is perfect. It has the stripe in the inside and it's just a classic piece that I'll just have over time. I've been having it for, for several years and it's, you know, as long as I'm putting it in the cleaners and keeping, um, keeping it in a good condition, this is what you need. Also, I found a, also I thrifted this Norma Kamali puff coat. Look at this. I think I got this for like $6. You guys have been seeing me thrift these things. And I mean, this is what I like to look for. I like to look for luxury pieces of quality that will last over time. You know, if it's cold outside, I can definitely wear this. I can layer it. I can wear, you know, like a, a hoodie underneath it. Um, but for the most part, um, I actually thrifted two of these, um, not at the same time, but this right here is um, perfect for the winter um, and actually um, in the fall, you can actually wear this too. So coats. So next would be, next would be bags. I think if you're starting your collection, it's important to, find a get a nice luxury bag and you can start off buying pre-loved if you're not comfortable spending all your coins <laughs> at the store so i this little cute little prada bag and i think you guys were with me a few weeks back that i can just wear this casually you know during the day if i'm walking around I could perfectly wear this with the things that I've been showing you with the, the Norma Kamali um, coat or even with my Burberry and also with the boot, a sleek boot. If you're looking to purchase and thrift or buy mainstream a um, luxury bag, you would could start off with Prada. Prada is reasonably priced. I mean, you can find some that are lower end and you can visit, you know, the real real or fashion file for um, for bags that are pre-loved. You know, if you want to kick it up a notch, you can purchase pre-loved. Um, this is a vintage Chanel bag that, you know, back in the day they had 10 karat chains and this is one of them. I don't know if you can see how beautiful the chain is, but this is a beautiful lambskin and this will elevate your look right away. I can just wear what I have right now on with some sneakers and as long as I have my bag, it's perfect. You know, one of the things, if you just have a nice coat and a bag and a pair of shoes, this will start your lux luxury collection off perfectly fine. You know what else? What else would be the next thing that you could do is, um, and I actually just thrifted it. Thrifting a, oh, do I have it? Do I have it anywhere? Thrifting a scarf. I just thrifted a beautiful Burberry scarf that's um, wool, wool, and you can layer that with a jean jacket, you know, the coats that I've shown you before, or a blazer. You know, a scarf can elevate your look in, in with just with just one one item. You could just have one item and it could elevate your look. Um, the next thing I would say, because we've covered what shoes, we've covered bags, we've covered coats, um, jewelry, jewelry. If you purchase or start your collection with some fine jewelry. I know I've been looking on, you know, a lot of um, social media tags and, you know, everyone's out getting the Van Cleefs or um, 
I don't know if folks remember, they used to have this collection called the Byzantine Collection. Um, it's a gold um, weaved um, piece of jewelry that looks very nice. If I if I can locate um, a photo of it, I'll put it in one of the, um, the corners, but a nice Byzantine link or... Um, um, let me show you some of the pieces that I have. So you can have like either costume jewelry. I love pieces like this where it just has my, um, it just has my initial C. And I actually got this from um, Nordstrom where they have all different um, initials. And I don't think this was more than, I don't think this was more than $60. I think it was like $54. And then also, if you want to have a little sparkle in your jewelry, I got this piece by David Yearman. Um, let's see, where is it? And this is another jeweled piece. And this also has my, um, my initials as well. Um, and if I can link these to I will link them below but yeah I love my initials and I've you can put you could put either of these pieces on with like a white t-shirt or a black t-shirt and the pieces that I've been showing you you could put on the boots you can put on the flats you you know and just rework your your piece also still still staying tuned with the 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 jewelry you always could get just one pair of high-end jewels and i selected these beautiful chanel earrings and you can wear these from an evening gown to a pair of jeans and let me show you how they look it's just they're just so cute look at that with a little ruby at the bottom Thought these were really cute and these are again these are pieces that you're starting off um, from your collection that you're gonna have and last over a lifetime for sure we always go out and get costume jewelry this is actually costume jewelry that I love these very large like spiked um, silver um, plated um, um, earrings where you know I can wear these with you know black I can wear I can wear it with a dress I can uh, tone it down but if you want to carry on pieces over a lifetime you know starting your your collection small and then gradually building sticking sticking still sticking to the jewelry piece you know just investing in a, a watch or a timepiece is key you know you can just you know I I actually wear my eye watch all the time but when going out you know I also have my um, I have my Michelle watch and I have my um, Lucy and Picard watch that I've been having I've been having this watch for I don't know well over 10 years and I love it because it's pastel pink and pastels coming back in right now so I have I like how it has the the pink dial and uh, my Michelle watch as well. Um, if I can show you how these look. But yeah, time pieces and jewelry will definitely elevate your look. Um, this will definitely start your luxury collection. And last, the last thing that I think that will help elevate your, your look, your scent. And my scent is Madawi. <laughs> We all know I have been parading around talking about how much I love Oud. And let me tell you, oh my God, if I can just, I want everything to smell like this. I want my pillows, I want my sheets. This is just divine. And when I walk into a room, people are like, who, where, how, who is that? They're asking who is wearing that. And it's me. I am wearing this. It's Madawi. And finding a luxury scent. I know folks were all into the rave of wearing, because um, I was too. I actually still wear it. The um, 
the MFK um, Baca de Rouge. Um, but finding your scent, whether it's, you know, YSL or Gucci or, or, or um, what else is out there? Um, the Joe Malone perfumes, they have an array of um, um, scents to choose from. But my Madawi Oud, I love it. I love it. So just carrying on a scent, you just need one. And because sometimes these perfumes could cost some, some pennies. So just investing in one or two that you can switch off or just having one. I know this retailed, I want to say this was about three, 300, don't get me wrong. I think it was either three or 350. Um, but I'm wearing, I'm, I'm getting cost per wear out of all the things that I've, I've shown you, whether it's been thrifted or I've purchased it from a uh, main house, I'm actually getting cost per wear because I'm wearing it in rotation. And that's why it's so important to just have pieces in your closet so you can get your cost per wear. So if you guys enjoyed this video, click like, share, subscribe, and tell a friend to come join our community. I would love to talk and show you some more of the finds that I've been getting. Until then, I'll see you guys soon.